first signal, first dig, first hole, literally chucked the machine on and walked two metres. And it just blows my theory completely out the window. That looks like it was in the same hole as. As that. And it is George Five, isn't it? Yeah. That's oh, really worn Hello. on the back. Hello. It's 19... Nice. One something. Oh, like a 1912 or 1913, whichever. Full silver. Happy days. Alright, let's see if I can get some more. Whatever happens now, I'm going home happy. Okay. See you soon. Okay, next. Looks like Queen Elizabeth II penny. Yeah. Nineteen sixty three. Okay, let's move on. Okay, next find. We just had to chase a load of kids off, entertain them for half an hour, show them what our machines done, what they were, how they worked, what you find. I gave him a penny and told him off, so he's gone now. Not that I didn't like kids, like he was just distracting me, that's all. Next find, a 1901 Veiled Ed Victoria. Nice condition. Alright, apologies for the language. Catch you the next one. Okay, next is a George Five Penny. Uh, can't quite get a date just yet. Nineteen seventeen, possibly. Okay, let's move on. Okay, next find. Four, five inches down. Another bit of silver. Yeah, going by the top, it looks like George Six. Judge six. Let's see, come on, nineteen forty four. Oh Yeah nineteen forty four. I got it. That completes a run of sixpences. Right from nineteen thirty nine up to forty five, I think. Happy days. All right, let's carry on. Okay, next find. Let me see there, still on the old. Nineteen twenty. Coins from this field come up lovely condition. Well, say that and look at that fucking corrosion on his head. But the majority of coins come up in lovely condition. Lovely green patina. Okay, let's see if that's just a print or if there's something else in the hole. All right, catch you at the next.
Okay, next find. In the hole here with all this plastic and, and this. This is a beautiful head with the seventh penny. 1910. I'm happy with them. I like Edwards. Okay. Let's move on. Okay, next find. Still in the hole. It's a penny. Let's try and get a date here. A big piece of glass there, look. 19. Oh, it must be a. Yeah, it's a Valdez Vicky. 1897. I like these pennies. These are my favourite. Favourite of the Georges and the Victorias. The Edwards and the Young Buns, these are my favourites. That's my second today. 1897. Just a three, two and a half inches down maybe. Made the pro pointer. Okay, where was it? There. You know, it's roughly. Yeah. It's about a third of a pro pointer. Okay. Let's move on. There we go, look at that. You've never know I've been. Okay, next out is a 1907 penny. Don't know if you can see that. The phone's not playing. It's going to be edited. King Edward the Seventh, or Bertie, as he was affectionately known by his mother. Okay, let's carry on. Okay, next signal. It was out of here, but it looks like a piece of wood. Show you on that side. Well, listen. It's a lovely signal that, so let's break it open to see. I feel anything in it. Oh, we are. Ha. What date's that? I think is that. Yeah. Another Bertie. There he is. Real close to the last one, within two meters. Okay, let's move on. Meat and cherry drops, by the way. Lovely they are. See you in a bit.
Okay, next thing up. Out of here. About three inches. It's in here somewhere. So, let's see. Ah, there it is. See it right there. Nineteen thirty seven. It's going to be George six. Nineteen thirty seven. So, wasn't that the first year of George six? Thirty seven. Was that the first year of George six? You know, if it wasn't for that little bit of corrosion there. You see all the raised edges and the beading all the way around it. Just a bit of corrosion on his neck. I know you've all seen pennies before, like, but I don't see them in this condition very often. Mine are usually black and full of crud. Alright, catch you in a bit.